I, <sighs> I have been MIA. When we showed this to audiences in the Mall of America, their responses were varied. Ludicrous was a word that we heard. Uh, deplorable? That was one. Uh, unwatchable? Yeah. <laughs> but all in all, they were good. When I was at that mall, just a through the guard, took me down to the bathroom, and I said, this is how you don't touch people. And I said, what? Uh, I shouldn't have said that, uh, should I? Are you, are you serious? Um, I'm just here to literally let everyone know that, like, I don't have the ability to like film. Am I moving soon? Yes. Um, so I wanted to live stream for you guys because I missed you and a lot of people like, do I have athlete's feet? No. Why did I get rid of the snake bites? Um, it wasn't really like a choice. I was working at an assisted living facility and they said, can't have those. So I had to take out my snake bites and then my nose piercing. When am I moving? Sooner than you guys think for sure. Why do I have so many supporters from France? Because, <laughs> because I forget her name. Oh my God. I Bonjour, you cheese eating surrender monkeys. Um, a famous YouTuber from around there um, made a like documentary style video on me. Actually two of them, uh, where she was like sticking up for me and stuff. We eat a lot. Surtout le McDo, hein. <laughs> big, uh, big uh, sandwich. Hein. They uh, eat a lot. Sur les burgers et tout. They like burger? Yes. yes. Hamburger. 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 Um, why am I all of a sudden doing a live? I thought about it for the last couple of days, to be honest, to just pop up on here and just talk to you guys. So everything is bigger in Texas. Oh my God. I guess I do belong there, eh? When's my next vlog? Um, God, I don't know. I feel like someone has to like be my boss. Cause right now, me being my own boss, I am failing. I need someone to boss me around. Feline? Yeah, and it's like, you know what's really weird? I never wanted dominance from anyone else in the past. Like, no to Becky, no to Destiny, no to Crystal. Like, I did not want that from anybody. Like, don't even. But with her, it's like different. I don't know how to explain it. Like, it's kind of hot. <laughs> no, me and Feline are not back together. It's just been, it's been a confusing situation type deal, but we're not back together and we're not going to be back together. How was the hookup? <laughs> People want to know how it went down. Am I allowed to like, <laughs> she don't care. She literally don't care what I say. I love that. Um, so what it was, was, um, my nose was like red and I was like, can you look at my nose? And like, I had my like flashlight and she just like looked into my eyes. <laughs> Um, she like looked into my eyes and it was like this like magnetic feel. <laughs> uh, it just happened. And then she just hardcore kissed me. Uh, so that, that's how that happened. People were asking about that. Not you blushing. I probably am. I love Feline. Like that's not going to change. Stephanie said you're irresistible. Stop your lying. But thank you. Um, who are you texting? A friend? No, I have not moved yet. No, I do want to vlog that whole process to the best of my ability. So do I like Ellie Golding? Absolutely. No, I do not have a new girlfriend. No. Um, um, thoughts on Feudy? Feudy! Foody? Chantel? Um, I don't really have any. I have literally not even been on YouTube. I haven't even been watching YouTube. Um... Mm-hmm. Will it hurt when Feline eventually moves on? Um, I don't think it'll hurt. No, no, because I want to see her happy. So, yeah, I am still on track. Oh my god, you guys will not believe how much weight I've lost. I could cry. Um, so I weighed myself today, and I was like, wow, okay. Um, I don't know. It kind of just like people always say, like, why haven't you like hit a rock bottom or like. So yeah, it was 5.43, you guys remember, and I was like dying on the inside. And today, you guys will not believe it, which has only been two weeks and two days. Are you guys ready? 
point something or other. So I've lost over 30 pounds in two weeks. You know what? I'm just going to tell you guys what I'm doing. And so there's no medicine involved. It's literally just fucking willpower, which is crazy. Okay. I was only allowing myself to eat two times, but listen, in a four hour time span. Um, so I would have my first meal at about like 7 p.m. And then I would, well, no, it was like eight. And then I would allow myself to have like 300 more calories around there of something else. So uh, what was I saying? <laughs> Literally, I lost everything that I was saying. My sleeping schedule is I've been waking up at 9 a.m. That is so early for me. I don't know how I'm doing it. So round of applause, please. I will wait. Okay. I go to bed at like 2 a.m. So 2 a.m. to 9 a.m. That's not that bad. That's pretty great. Anyways, long story short, the second week, I've kind of only been eating like once a day, <laughs> but I literally took everything that I thought I knew about weight loss and I said, fuck it. Um, and I just want to do like what would make me feel the best. And that's literally how I've lost over 30 pounds. And it's like, I'm not even eating a ton at once. And I think that's probably why I'm dropping so much weight because I feel like I might be like under eating a little bit for so long. I was like, oh my God, I don't want to under eat, but it's like, bitch, please. Like you need to lose weight, like get your shit together. Um, so I have not felt better. Like it is absolutely insane. And of course there's been a couple times where I'm like, okay, wait, I'm a little hungry. So I always allow myself to have 300 calories. I don't know what it is. I don't know. I'm just really proud of myself to be honest. I am. So I'm gonna try not eating at all. Like for real, it's so mean. Have I been exercising? No, I have not. Someone said you can't text at work. <laughs> okay. Oh, do I have a boss? Wait, I need a boss. For real. Am I excited for my new apartment? Yes. Um, sorry, I just <sighs> someone said I'm texting Bay. <laughs> texting Bay. She's so silly. Oh my god, stop. That is not oh my god, that's not happening. I don't have a bay. Oh yeah, I do need to change my Instagram name for sure. I just don't know. Like who who wants to create my name for me? Like what should it be? Yes, I am still doing Delta. So I'm still getting high. Yeah, I am. Amber is such a pretty name. Thank you. I hate my name. So that makes me really happy. Thank you. Yes, Feline still lives here. Why do I hate my name? Mm, good question. Amber does nothing for me. So that's why I was like, you know what? I'm going to put my middle name onto my first name and we're going to like call it a day. Can you give one hint about the state you're moving to? Okay. Um, Let me think of a hint first. <laughs> um ice <laughs> no one's gonna understand that i feel like i'm just gonna say ice for sure no not meth no like ice that you slip on like you like walk outside and you like fall on your ass that ice what do you mean oh my god y'all thought i was talking about drugs i can't talk about drugs on here <laughs> ice ice baby i don't know why i used ice as a as a thingy do I have fetal alcohol syndrome? You guys are really mean sometimes. No, I do not. You guys, I have gray hairs. You guys, I'm getting old. You guys, I'm like grandma territory. I'm literally a grandma. I cannot believe it. Like, I'm aging. I'm no age of Adeline, I could tell you. Um, Wait, hold on. Hold on, I have a business call. This is my business call. Or a business text. Am I wearing pants? No. <laughs> no, I'm not actually. Stand up for us? I totally would. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, I thought you meant. No, you're not. No, I would get kicked off of here. I thought you meant stand up like. Like if someone was making fun of you and being mean or something. <laughs> so done i'm so done um, why is it i know i'm not wearing pants some people don't wear pants when they're in their home um was the hookup worth it what does that mean i don't know what that means really you guys think i should eat today <laughs> my mind is in the gutter my mind is in the gutter sorry sorry uh, eat a bug okay i don't have bugs so i can't really do that
Yes, I'm still ordering takeout. Just stop. Stop overhead, okay? I'm down over 30 pounds in two weeks. Tell me how. Tell me how, please. It's called OMAD. Like, what? What? So crazy. <sighs> mm-hmm. Why are you licking your lips during a business text? What does that even mean? What? I was not licking my lips. Is this a sex work text? What? I don't do sex work. Girl, you kill me with the comments you read. <clears throat> yeah. So the Lego Titanic, um, Feline's family took it. So I know people were like um, upset that I got rid of it. Um, how much money do you think you've spent on toward over the years? I actually have the answer to this close to about 10,000. Do you feel like if you got skinny, you'd almost like lose part of your identity? Yeah. Yeah. Because it's like, I feel like when people look at me, that's all they see. I'm always going to be bigger. I'm always going to be bigger. I, my goal is health and, um, hold on. Sorry. I keep getting distracted. Oh my god kill me now without like me being this size like it's going to be different because i know people are going to treat me different my identity is going to change for the lack of a better um term no i do not have a new girlfriend i promise 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 girl trying to hold back a smile i promise y'all no oh you guys are so funny what am i going to eat um i might look at uber and decide <laughs> um i use the good uber eat moment you're way too giggly. Um, hmm. Am I? I don't know. I'm afraid to laugh. I swear, if I laugh, that means I'm married. If I look down at my phone, it means I'm freaking... I can't. Someone said I'm high on meth. I cannot. What is the point of this live? Um, I don't know. Just to talk. Um, what aren't you telling us? Ooh, that's a good question. A lot. I'm not telling you guys a lot. A lot, a lot. Um... Someone just said, did you pierce your, I don't think I'm allowed to say that on YouTube, but no, I would never, when I was in the mental hospital, when I was 15, what, my first roommate there, I was only there for, it was four days. So anyways, she had her clitoris pierced and she pulled it out in front of me. I will never forget that in my life. I still have friends from there and I was literally only there for four days. Like it was such an interesting experience. I will say that. Sorry, I'm putting the phone down. The phone is down. The phone is down. Like, I can't. I can't. Don't get me started, please. Thanks. Um, <laughs> texting Feline to bring you snacks. Yep. Why won't I move to Indiana? Indiana? Indi Indiana? Indiana? Did I say that right? Um, I don't know. <laughs> Just not really for me, I guess. Um, Come to New York City. Oh my God, wouldn't that be crazy? That's kind of the opposite direction of where I'm trying to like go though. Um, the rumors about my mom and a dog are actually false. Absolutely not true. No, I'm not moving to Arizona. <clears throat> I will never ever live there again. No. Um, <laughs> sorry. How do you journal? Um, do you draw or use colors? It's literally just writing and I only allow myself to use black ink. I kind of want seafood boil. If I'm being like 100% honest, that's what I want. That is what I want. Am I worried about living alone? No, not at all. Um, have you ever thought of staying single? No, I'm just kidding. Um, I am single. So yeah, that's that. Um, would I take Feline back? That is such a complicated question. Mm -mm. I wouldn't though. Girl, we know it's a yes. I promise. I promise it's not. It's just, it's like complicated. It's like, you can answer with one word, sure. But there's like so much like in between before you want to answer with just that one word. That's how it feels. So. I sound like I'm 13. Okay. Why? What's with the phone? What do you mean? I just have like a friend who needs me right now.
Are your pets going with you? Yes, I did everything I could to find a place where I was allowed to take all three of my babies. Okay, cool. I'm, I'm glad. Um, your smug face. Oh, what does smug mean? I feel like I've never felt that way, but like people call me smug. So then I start to believe that maybe I am. See, that's what happens. Like people tell me something about myself that like, that's not true, but then I start to believe it. Like, oh my God, when people didn't believe that I had cancer, that was like, and she was just like, you're healthy. Like she, she had my charts in her hand. She was like, you're healthy. In that moment, I was just like, fuck. I went through this weird breakdown where I was like breaking down, like going through all of my paperwork, like literally like, oh my God, like was I actually diagnosed? Was I just fucking crazy? Like. I have pamphlets upon pamphlets that I have received recently from the cancer center. And I know what it means when I am told repeatedly when I just want to forget that I have. But like, it just goes to show that like being gaslit, it messes with you hard. And um, people make you believe things that aren't true and it's scary. Did you find a moving company? Um, Kind of, sorta. Nothing's like set in stone yet. Am I taking Ozempic again? No, 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 I'm not. Do you think you're the problem in relationships? Okay. <clears throat> um, I can be, I can be. I actually saw something on Facebook recently. Facebook, I know I'm so old. That's what Feline says. <laughs> the old people on Facebook said, um, you know, I want to work on myself because honestly, sometimes I am the problem and it's true. Aww. Hi, baby girl. Yeah. Um, tell us a book you read and love this year. God, this year I have not done like any reading. I think maybe the beginning of the year I read a lot, maybe, but I have none. So I think I'm gonna um start a book today. So I'm excited for that. It's something like kind of different compared to what I've read before. So I think it could be fun. The next book I'm reading is called The Ruins. So yeah, I actually haven't done Legos in a long time either. Oh my God, <gasps> am I depressed? <laughs> Wait. Wait, I don't do anything that I used to do. I don't do Legos. I, as much as I love journaling, I've low key, like don't do it as much anymore. Um, wow. Interesting. Okay. So is that like a depression moment? Sometimes I feel depressed. Sometimes I don't want to get out of bed. Sometimes I cry. Sometimes I feel low. So it's fine though. Um, no, I don't take medicine anymore. Cause it's like, this is going to sound bad and I don't want it to, because I feel like this is my, like, sorry, my nose itches. This is like my story, but I feel like environmental problems play like a big role in someone's mental health. And I feel like if you're in a situation that makes you feel sad a lot, then you're going to fucking feel sad a lot. Get yourself out of it. Troll city. Tell me how fat I am. Roast me in those super cities because I need to pay my freaking internet bill. You know what I'm saying? So do it. I'm sorry. Sorry. Um, work, work emails. <laughs> I'm just messing around. How often do I answer Instagrams? Literally never. Like if I text you, like if we're texting, be shook because your girl hates texting. So if I am texting you, just know, <laughs> will you marry me? Oh, I'm flattered. Yes, I will. I'm officially married, you guys. I hate texting. Oh my God. And I hate talking on the phone. I hate FaceTiming. So someone said I look like Beyonce. Stop. <laughs> I've been texting the whole time because I'm texting a friend. It's me. Um, YouTube is toxic. It can be. I'm not flirting. Oh, we're doing this again. Okay. Stop. Is my friend watching the live stream? I don't think so. Is my friend a woman? Yes. Yes. Um, Slay Queen. 
Did I take a Delta gummy? Yes. Someone just said you don't have mental illness. I'd love that. You have the same choker on? <gasps> Wait, are we twinning? I am starting to like Trisha more. Like there was, like you guys know, I went through like an obsession with her. Like I loved her so much like years ago. It's because her and Pink Sparkles were the first YouTubers I ever found. And now I'm like friends with Pink Sparkles. Like we text and we're like friends, like we're friends. Yeah, the journey of like watching Pink Sparkles and like being a fan of her. And then all of a sudden I'm like her friend. Like it's weird, I will say. Um, but the journey with Trisha Paytas was I was super obsessed with her. And then I just, after Frenemies, I, I, I almost hated her. Like, but since she's became a mom, like she's so different now. And I can see that she wants to improve. And I love that. And it's inspiring, honestly. Shrek toilet shirt. I mean, sure. I, yeah, I, yeah. Press on nail end was a savage. Stop. It did not change my, I always talk with my hands. I'm an, like always. What am I having for dinner? What am I eating? I don't know. Um, I kind of want seafood boil. I have had seafood boil twice, actually. Um, in the last two weeks. And, oh my God, a live mukbang. Can you imagine a live mukbang of Amberlynn Reed eating a seafood boil? I know that it's a bunch of water weight right now. Water, water, water weight, water weight. Wow. Y'all, I don't mess around with the seafood boil. <laughs> it's so bad. It's like, it's now my favorite food. It's my like favorite meal. <laughs> Twinkie, it's okay. <laughs> Baby girl. I Hi. Hi. Um, she's also probably mad at me. She has a vet appointment this week and she's mad about it. Oh yeah. She gets some cut at the vet. But, um, there was like a hidden camera. Um, and I saw a video of it, like at this like famous dog grooming place and like everyone loved them, but dogs were getting abused every day. Why? That's just your sister. So, oh my God. She's so, funny. someone was walking past again. Uh huh. Oh my God, Twinks. Um, no, Feline still lives here. She was just in here with me. Hi. She's like a little shark coming to get me. That's why I call her my little shark. So this is, this is how it goes. Rarity is a shark. Twinkie is a seal. And Wasabi is a skunk. Oh my God, is that the real Yo Mama? Stop. Hold on. You guys want to see me flirt? I'll show Yo Mama is so cute. I don't think he knows that, that I think that though. Thank you, Yo Mama. I appreciate this. Oh, <laughs> uh, wow. That's funny. All right. I need to go. I'm just getting myself in trouble. <sighs> Why am I like this? Someone said I should do blonde ombre. Can you just imagine me for two seconds with blue eyes and blonde hair? I don't like her. That wouldn't look good on me. Um, okay. But yeah. Um, do a crazy color. Mm. What color would I do? Like red or like blue? I don't know. Green eyes and a dirty blonde might work. Wow. There's a song about you. I know your mama. Like, yeah. Your mama's songs are funny. I will say. I am a lesbian. I can still think he's cute. Like, wait. Like, his personality is so funny. Like, he is so funny. And he's funny. I just think he's cute. There's nothing wrong with that. But I am a lesbian. So it's not like I'm, you know, and he's married. Y'all, come on. I'm asking him to be my work husband right now. So, yo mama, would you like to marry? <laughs> I don't read the farms. I know nothing about that. I'm not part of any of that. So, and I'm not going to be part of any of that. Uh, no, I do not watch Jessica Messica at all. <laughs> She's really in it to win it right now. Are you on dating apps? No, I'm not a dating app girly. Like I used to be, but. But, um, I think it would be, I don't know. I think it would be really funny. I, I really, really do. Um, she hates me. I hate her. It's like a whole moment. It would be literally, our podcast would be called like the exes or something. No, I don't, I don't know what it would be called, but it would be good. I promise it would. I don't know. I really just want a podcast with somebody, but it has to be someone that's like, I want a little like controversy. Versi. 
I want it to be like a little like controversial. I want like there to be drama. I want them to be talkative. I want them to be like engaging. Like it has to be like the perfect person. So Destiny would be one. Um, me and Eric aren't friends anymore, but if we were, he would be another. Um, I feel like it could have been such a cool dynamic because Eric and I like privately, we would talk for hours without stopping. And it was just like constant conversation. Um, <laughs> yo mama, stop. Oh, I'm blushy. Yo mama. Okay. <laughs> if we had a podcast, that'd be interesting. I'm not gonna lie. Cause you're funny. Um, a flirty Lynn. I, I, yeah, I'm a flirt when I'm single. I am a flirt. It is, it is a thing. Um, oh yeah, it is a thing. Do you influence <laughs> Oh my god, I'm not gonna tell you about our sexcapades. And then a lot of lesbians, not me though, I will tell you this now, likes oral sex, scissoring. When she thinks she's flirting, it's just yuck. Stop, you guys are gonna make me never flirt again. <laughs> Am I bad at it? Oh, oh no. Oh my god. Um Would you ever do a podcast with Feline? No. And that's only because she's such a private person and I want her to stay like that. How will you get around um when you're living alone since you don't drive? There's like an Uber moment, people that I know, whatever it may be. Um where did you get your choker from? Um hmm. Where did I get this one from? I don't know. Driving scares me. Driving scares me. Like it really does. Um, people say, do you not trust yourself then to drive? Well, it's not even just like about myself. It's about everyone else around me. And um, it's just scary. I don't know. I don't know. It just gives me anxiety. Um, someone said I couldn't fit in a car. Oh my God. Stop with the fat shaming. It's okay. I promise it'll be okay. What's your favorite workout or physical activity to do? Oh yeah, my brain instantly. My brain lives in the gutter. She stays in the gutter for a little bit. So I'm sorry about that. Um, would you ever date a viewer? Yes, I would. Um, wouldn't dating a viewer be a weird power imbalance? Hmm. I never really thought about that because I don't see myself as above a viewer. I don't see myself as more powerful than them or better or I don't know. I don't know. I guess if I switched roles. What if I was to date someone that I watched online? Um, how would that make me feel? I wouldn't feel any different. I don't know. I don't know. I actually never thought about it like that. What's your favorite sex position? Oh my God. Stop. I love, okay. Should, am I allowed to say this? Press one if I should answer. Press two if I shouldn't. Mm. Wow. I'm shocked. <laughs> I I love fingering. So that's my favorite. A lot of people think I'm a pillow princess. <laughs> I'm not, I promise. Oh no, I'm not. Like, um, oh yeah. Um, sorry. <laughs> I grossed y'all out. <laughs> oh, Haley, thank you. I love you so much. Thank you. A heart for you. Wait, I should start doing that. Heart for you. <laughs> oh my God. So yeah that's that's like my favorite i love it so much so that's my favorite yeah yeah mm -hmm. do not call me fingerlet do not call me that i'm scared mom you should do a after dark live stream oh wow okay hold on a second someone asked giving or receiving um um i would say that i i want to be the giver yeah i'm not a pillow you guys you can ask feline i mean she's not gonna answer she's not in the room anymore but trust me not true okay i'm gonna go um i hope that you guys enjoyed it was really really fun this time i'm serious so love y'all and i will see you guys soon bye emotion see through your flaws I know that you got so much more to give